Welcome to Tech Ranch, a place where we learn and earn technical skills in the most efficient way. Let's make coding fun. Java game application development, Connect 4. Today we are going to present you a live demonstration of Connect 4 game application implemented using JavaFX Graphical User Interface API. Before we get into the demonstration, let's first see what are the requirements. Connect 4 is a two-player control game where the player has to set the four consecutive same colored coins that will be the winner and will have the winner announcement alert box and which has a player turn control game. So when it comes to the rules, let's see what are the rules. The two players then alternate taking turns, dropping one of their discs or coins at a time into an unfilled column until the second player with red disc or coin achieves a diagonal four in a row and wins the game. If the board fills up before, either player achieves four in a row, then the game is a draw. So this is what the requirements and the rules and how to play this Connect 4 game. Now let's take a look at the implementation which we are where we are going to use uh, Java FX Graphical User Interface API. So this particular game application is bay, is in um, many ways you can implement, and I am following MVC Model View Controller design pattern to implement this game, where we have few classes included in this application like Connect 4 Launcher, which is basically a main launcher which is initiating your graphical user interface component and overridden the start method. Now it starts from there. There you will see the start method, which is defined and implemented in Connect for graphical user interface API, where we have created the stage, created the disk or coin using paint and graphics. Now from graphical user interface, when it comes to the model, because we need, after creating the graphics, we need to control it. And we need to provide a logic that will control it. So that particular car part comes in the game model. Now game model class will have the player turns controller, which will, which will update the grid once the player turns taking turns is done, or if in case the player wins the game. And display the game results announcement by uh, just popping the dialog box or alert box, anything like that you can add. Now, when it comes to the model and the view and the controller, we have to make sure the all those uh, data is collecting from all the classes and communicating to other classes. So that's why we have a player class that will set the coordinates for graphical user interface, presenter, which will have the getter and setter methods implementation for player turns and results, and the resources, which is nothing but the style sheets for creating graphics and styles for the frame which is just a part of the presenter or you can see a viewer so where in this way we have resources are nothing but the class is just a file or a folder which has a css file so if you see the model view controller design pattern is implemented in this game where we have the model and the viewer and the controller so this is how we can implement and there are so many ways you can implement this type of games. Now let's take a look at the demonstration. So this game will looks like this where we have the button to play a game and you can see the label which says the player and that will nothing but the game status that the current player is player one and uh, once it's taking turn is done the next turn will be player two to take turn and you can choose the color. You can repaint these colors into your Connect for graphical user interface class, where we have created the coins using paint. So you can color other colors also, green and blue or anything, or black and white, whatever types of uh, coins or disk you want to put it in your Connect 4 game. Now, there are so many ways you can improvise this, but here it is just a very basic uh, game application for Connect 4. Now, let's take a look at the demonstration. So, this is my Eclipse ID, and here is my application. It's a Java application, and inside the Java application, 
we have a uh, connect for a package inside that package we have uh, make all the model view and controller type of classes with resources you can see the resources folder here now this is my launcher now let's start the execution so you see this is my stage and uh, play again is the button and your turn and player one this is the player one whose turn it is so what you can do suppose i take the turn like this i'm yellow you can repaint it using graphics in uh, uh, this uh, class if you see this class here you can repaint it to other colors yeah you can make it yellow or you can make it green and red or green and blue whatever you want to change the color and uh, player two now player one now player two now player one now player two now player one now player two so in case if it is uh, nobody win the game then it would be draw so player one player two and player one wins so this is what the game uh, winner announcement using alert box so you see the four yellow is together all are them in the consecutive set of yellow coins so that makes the player one wins the game you can play again we'll reset it again and in case if you want to restart it in the middle of the game you can do that too so for example i wanted to reset again and it will reset play again so basically it works on the arrays and which has the number of coins six cross six so this is what the console you can see six cross six so this is a six by six uh, matrix and where we are using uh, red and yellow two variables which is uh, pointing to that coordinate you see let's make the player two win the game this time and see if it will work so as you can see you can make the diagonal also player one wins again okay let's try again let's make the red coin wins the game this time and see how it will work it's actually very simple and basic game player two wins the game this time you see the all red are in the coordinate and the diagonals so this is the winner so this is the demonstration of uh, connect four game application implemented in java fx you can improvise by using timer points and deploy it in an internet web server and make it online this is very basic you can use it many ways and implement it number of ways this is one of the very basic ways you can uh, improvise by using some add-on features like points and uh, score points and uh, timer and uh, uh, de it deployed it in internet and make it online and play with other friends in the social network so this is what the Connect4 game application implemented using JavaFX Graphical User Interface API. In case of any questions, concern, or source code, please contact and email to techranch2019 at gmail.com. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel and stay tuned for more upcoming interesting informative sessions and demonstrations. Let's make coding fun. Thank you.